Good morning. It is half past four. That was my mum and my sister leaving. They are flying back to the UK today. I've been awake for an hour since half past three. I'm going to try to go back to bed. Hopefully go back to sleep for a few hours before we have to check out and move on. I'm going to leave in Kuta today. But yeah, I'm going back to sleep. I'll see you in a little bit. My sister brought this uh, green tea kit kit yesterday from London downstairs. Just found it in the fridge. I think she wants it for the jury. I've got your green tea kit kit kit. Did you want it? Yes. I just saw it in the fridge. I thought, oh! Looks very strange at this time in the morning. I probably wish I was doing that right now. Oh, it's many hours later now and I did manage to go out to sleep, which was very good for quite a few hours to be honest. I'm just starting the pack up. We have mess everywhere. As I said, we're moving to Upbo today. I don't know how we're getting there at the moment. I think that possibly there are buses that run from Kuta to Upbo. So potentially we'll take a bus or we might just take a taxi or something. I'll have a little look later, but I'm going to pack up first. I don't even know where we're staying. I haven't got anywhere booked yet. Very unorganised, but it'll just, it'll get sorted. This one's still asleep. I need to wake him up so we can go and get our... Oh! Oh my goodness! <laughs> He's scared the life out of me! I've just woken him up talking, I think. Um, yeah, it's like 10 o'clock-ish, so we need to go downstairs. Get our last breakfast here in Kuta Town Houses. Okay, housekeeping has just knocked on the door and said, um, do we want our room cleaning? I was like, well, we're checking out today, so, you know, we don't want it doing. And I'm like, you check out tomorrow. And I've just checked. And we do, I've booked it for, I said, like, weeks ago, when my mum and sister first arrived, I was like, I think, I've got a feeling that I've booked it until the 20th, but I don't know why I've booked it until the 20th. Like, in my mind, they were leaving on the 20th. Um, yeah, I've just checked my book and it is the 20th, so I don't know what to do now, I don't know whether to, I kind of don't really want to stay here on night, but it seems silly if we've paid to stay. Stay? To leave, you want to stay? Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do now. <laughs> I'll get back to you when we've had a thing. We'll go and get breakfast and we'll have a think. So we went down for breakfast and we decided that we're going to stay here. It just seems really silly. We've paid £64 a night, which is crazy out of our budget. But obviously it was like a holiday, a family holiday thing. So we kind of blew the budget for the last couple of weeks. But it seems silly to pay the £64 for tonight. But as well, we've got like breakfast in the morning included in the price. So we can get like a good meal out of it. Um, yeah, like we are on a budget and... It's, it just seems silly to go and spend like £10 on another room. And we've got this room plus a meal, so we're going to stay. Not really sure what we're going to do with the day, whether it could just be, like I'm a crazy behind with work, because like with having my mum and my sister here, I haven't been doing as much work as I probably should have been doing, so could it be a catch up with work day or we could go on a little day trip? No idea, as yet. So as you can see, we've decided on a hotel day at the moment. I'm just sitting doing some work. This one has just gone. He's so excited. He's managed to find Flash, uh, the TV, the TV series. I don't know really what it is. I don't watch it, but um, Flash season three. He's managed to find that, and so he's uh, watching a little bit of that whilst I do some work. We will go out later on, but for now, some work, catch up on a load of stuff that I haven't been doing over the last few weeks. I've got to be honest though, that looks really quite inviting. I could just do that myself today, like wrap up. I know that's probably awful, like we've got a pool, a beach, a gorgeous location. And all we want to do is <laughs> just curl up on the sofa with a comfy night, with a nice cosy duvet and a film or something. That sounds like perfect. But I'm not going to do that. He can do that. I'm going to work. It is many, many hours later. As you can see, it is now dark. We've just been just at the hotel all day, not really doing much particularly but we're gonna head out and grab some tea for last evening i was thinking of going down to the beach for sunset but it kind of just time crept up on us and it didn't really happen uh, but yeah we're gonna have a little walk out and get some tea possibly do you think in pool or no pool 
no pool. Probably no pool, but potentially we might go in the pool for one last night. So it's so quick. We're out here just having tea. We've come back to the place where we first came when we very first arrived. Pronto Pizza. Like just home to pack and yeah, is that the plan? Yeah. No pool, no anything. Yeah, we're just gonna go home. I am really ready to leave Kusha to be quite honest. It's not <laughs> yeah, it's not particularly my type of place. Like it's been a wonderful two weeks uh, with my mom and sister and everything, but definitely first kid with a helmet on. Yeah, and ever you never see a kid with a helmet on in this place. Uh, in Asia, to be honest, like the the driver, the my boat, the what? The, the, the boat, <laughs> the boat, the driver of the boat. No idea. Where's well, the boat? The driver. I'll have a helmet on, but the kid won't. Um, what was I saying? I've completely forgotten. I have no idea. It was probably a load of rubbish. Um, oh, I don't know what I was saying. Yeah, that I'm kind of ready. It's not my type of place, and we probably wouldn't have stayed here really. Like it was just me and Stephen, but I mean, it was good for the purpose of like having my mum here and things, so it all works out pretty well. But I am definitely, oh, I'm gonna get one over. I think this is what's gonna happen. I'm definitely ready to leave. Stephen Green. What? We're well, on second quarter, isn't that? What's all this down your top? flower. Maybe. We'll wash it. You take it off when you get up and we'll wash it and it can dry overnight. Run! <laughs> too fast for me. Oh yeah definitely too fast for me. Oh my goodness I was just about to say you best not even think about locking me out but oh there's a cat there's a cat. Open the door and see if he comes in. Is it alive? <laughs> yeah. Oh, we're nice, friendly people. Come back. No. Oh, we could have our own bedrooms today, tonight, if we wanted. Yeah. Yeah. Are you gonna check out if he's still there? Is he still there? I don't want to scare him. Oh, is he gone? Oh, 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 oh. We've never seen it come down this way. Let's just go and have a little explore. Where does this go? Oh no, the keys in the door as well. Oh, this is the yeah, because this is the pool. Look, there's our balcony. That one there. That'd be cool if we just jump over. Let's keep going. See where it leads. Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa, does it just keep going all the way around? Oh, hello, we found you! Imagine if you just went, rah! I'd <laughs> run. <laughs> I feel like he might do any second and I'm going home. Good luck. <laughs> My plan was to come home and pack, but the reality of it is, is I'm just not going to, I can't be bothered. To be quite honest, I'm going to get into bed and do a little bit of Instagram work and bed and stuff and leave all this mess that I kind of started.